everyone welcome back to how tech today we have an iphone 14 pro this is a nice purple one deep purple and uh, we're going to show you how to add or remove a contact so you want to find your address book which you should be able to find it's actually hidden nowadays they don't put it on the first page they put it under here under contacts so on an iphone it's called contacts not address book uh, so you can click here or you can actually go to the phone and if you go to here to contacts it's basically the same thing if you want to create a new contact in this case because we have no contacts they ask you to do it so you could click here but if you've already got some you can always click on the plus up here and then create a new contact so you can add a name so first name last name so let's just do joe blow and you can add extra information like the company the phone number so let's put in one two three four five six seven eight and you can add other phones and you can adjust the label on these. So these are the defaults. You could also add like, uh, I don't know, secret uh, phone, something like that as a new label. And so now I can put in his secret phone. Um, so you can just add those and those show up for any future person that you're adding as well. Um, so yeah, that you also add email and you can adjust the ringtone. This is actually really cool because that means, you know, if you set a unique one, whenever I get a call from this specific contact, I'll get that specific ringtone. So I'll know without even looking at the phone who's calling me uh, just from a sound. So obviously use it for important people that, uh, you know, maybe will call you frequently, but not all the time, but you definitely want to answer it. So you want to make sure that you recognize it in a good way. Like, so for example, if it's your kids, you want to know, like, even if you're in a meeting, uh, or even if you're in the office, you'll pick it up. Whereas a normal call, you'll just let it go to voicemail. So anyway, that's the ringtone. Also the text tone, similar for text messages. You can also add extra information like website, address, birthday, other key dates like anniversaries or whatever, uh, related names. So you could like link them to other people, social profiles, instant messages, and then notes. So they also have some additional fields, which uh, you can see from here. So I don't know, these weren't important enough to put in the default list, but they're also kind of set, so you can't change it. But so yeah, now you can see phonetic last name. So phonetically spelled below, for example. So one last thing is you can add a photo. So for example, uh, you can either go to your photo album, you can actually take a picture on the spot. You can change the color and the default pics from these default icons and emojis. But I think the camera one is the best. So in this case, I can just say like, okay, assuming that was a picture of Joe Blow. Now, whenever, and I can even set a filter on it. Whenever I get a call from Joe Blow, now that picture is going to pop up. So maybe I'm really bad with names, but I'm good with faces. Uh, but it's just nice to have it kind of personalized so that, you know, especially for text messages, all this thing, this icon will show up. So that's how you add a contact. So this is once the contact is added, you can basically call them, message them, and then you can even do like uh, send them a message, share the contact, share your location, block them, add them as an emergency contact. But then now if you want to delete them, you can basically go here and then down at the bottom, delete contact. You can also do that, I believe, on a bulk basis here. So I think if I hold it down, I can actually delete them. Yeah. So yeah, that's basically how you can add and remove contacts and you can even make lists as well. So save that for another video. So if you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. That's how to add and remove a contact for the iPhone 14 Pro. See you guys next time, bye. Everyone, welcome back to HowTech. Today we have a hot off the presses iPhone 13 Pro Max dual physical SIM Hong Kong version. And today I'm gonna to show you how to insert and remove